How's it going guys? Welcome back to the channel. This is Eve Luck coming to you with another video on Demon Slayer Season 4, Episode 2 to the Hashira or Hashira Training Arc. Now, before we get into it, like the video guys and subscribe and do not forget to follow me on my other social media platforms like TikTok, where I do my fitness and martial art videos. And I'm going to uh, leave the link of my rumble as well. My rumble is where I'm going to uh, put the volume of the anime reactions that I will be doing from here on out. So don't forget to follow me there as well. If you want to get a full feel of the um, anime reaction videos and you can hear the volume and you can, you know, do all that because rumble is now a free speech app and it's been there for quite some time it's just that i haven't taken uh a well use of it over time ever since uh rumble has been active so without further ado let's check out the second episode on demon slayer season four and see what took place Yubu Yashiki. They're yeah, inviting her. I think she she will be safer there, no? Maybe not. Because Muzan Kibitsuji knows that the Hashira or Yaboyashiki's mansion is held in Nezuko in there. And if he is to get to Nezuko, he's going to have to deal with all these Hashiras. It could also be the reason why um, Muzon Kibitsuji haven't acted just yet. He's gathering his armies that you can rest assured on that. He's planning something.
Yep. The move to defeat moves on Kibitsuji at last. To Yubuyashki's mansion. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I would say that everything that has happened thus far has made the Hashiras or Demon Slayers very, very alerted. Based on the recent change, Nezuka can now walk under the sun. And like I said on my review on season three, the last episode, and I did a separate video talking about this, Muzan will stop at nothing. Right? He will stop at nothing to get his hands on, on uh, Nezuko. This is, this is a miracle for him, and he will do everything in his powers to get to Nezuko one way or the other, because this is a miracle. If he gets the ability to walk under the sun, you guys know how many things, bad things he will do next. And that's, again, that's the reason why the Hashiras are doing everything in their powers to prevent this from coming to fruition. And I like the fact that Tanjiro got a new blade. Oh my goodness. You see, openings have a way of telling you stuff. He's really sick, huh? He can barely move. His sickness has gotten really, really worse. That sounds so annoying, and he's busy meditating.
<laughs> He's really trying to be nice about it. Whoa, he has some a lot of things that he has to work on. He's um There's a lot going on inside him. So he's upset at Tanjiro because Tanjiro haven't learned water breeding to be a master of it, to be the water hashira, water breeding hashira. Well, he was the one that uh, got to Tanjiro at first, right? And Tanjiro was learning water breeding and was using it at first before he changed, he started to tweak his abilities a bit. He can, he can barely sleep now. So he never passed the final selection.
Now I understand. Now I understand. It makes absolute sense. Why he's been the way he's been. That's actually true. They are similar. They went through a similar situation. Because if Tanjiro was strong like the way he is now, he would have put up a good fight with uh, Rengoku against Akaza. Oh, that, that stopped him in his tracks.
How come? Doshta no. Oh, wow, that's it. Damn. Okay. Let me watch this outro for a bit. Then I'm going to give my... Well, while I'm talking, I can be watching it at the same time. Now, ladies and gentlemen... Now we know why Ginyu is the way he's been. Kind of makes sense. You know, he lost a good friend of his, a good teacher of his, a good role model of his when he was coming up. And that triggered a... It triggered something in his head that... Uh, he has not been able to overcome for a very long time. You know, even though that uh, Sabito was a big mentor to him and mentored him to not let the sacrifice his sister made go unnoticed, to cherish it, to honor it, and not give up and continue to live to develop his abilities. But due to the fact that uh, Sabito died, the grief of that tortured him badly that he never left him up until this day. Well, up until Tanjiro uh, spoke to him and triggered a memory that he forgot, triggered a memory that he should have carried on, triggered a memory that he should have cherished, right? So... Now Ginyu has finally found himself, I think, once again. Now he's going to take this Hashira training a little seriously now. Now we can see what he's made out of. And for the fact that Tanjiro is with him, Tanjiro can now pick up his water breathing technique, maybe added to what he has learned thus far. Because that dragon dance he used on season three, that was amazing. Beheading those three demons. Oh man, that was that that was just amazing. If he can, you know, add it the water breathing to his arsenal, because water breathing was what he was using at first, you know, and then after Rengoku died, things kind of tweaked a little bit for Tanjiro. So um, we'll see what happens on the next episode. But thank you guys for joining me on this reaction. Be free to like the video and subscribe. And let me know what you think on the comment section about uh, the video. And like I said, don't forget to follow me on my other social media platforms like Instagram, TikTok. Uh, TikTok is where I do my martial art and fitness videos. And um, I'm going to start uploading full reactions with full volume uh on my rumble uh website you know because rumble is this free free speech with no hostile hostile you know hostility or copyright with you know videos or um copyright on your content like youtube is so i'm going to uh start uploading there you can find me on rumble with the same name evlog you know uh evlog so look look out for me there and on tiktok with the same name as well evlog so uh don't forget to support me guys 
over there and uh thank you for watching this video with me and i will try to upload season three i will try to watch the reaction as soon as i can um so that uh you know i'll try to get to this story as soon as possible simply because kangan ashura season two part two if i'm not mistaken it's coming very soon in august so i have to uh get ready for kangan ashura and i know there are other animes that i have missed during the time i was away like ninja kamui uh blood of zeus um other animes uh, summer animes that came out that i have missed and I, I know i <laughs> i'll get to them one by one because I'm, I'm very busy like youtube is what i do when i'm not busy you know youtube is what i do as a hobby now um my full career i'm doing it vividly and it's taking a lot of time out of my 24 hours so i no longer have the time that i used to have before uh because i have something else going on that i'm doing as a main career work so um but again your support your participation it can do some miracles that will cost me to make time even though i know there is no time it will cost me to make time because to make these videos the equipment the uh, gadgets you know all these things cost money and please support the channel make sure to uh you know participate on the videos the comments i see a lot of people come in they watch the video but they don't give their thoughts and their take on the video or to like the video well enough i don't know what's going on but Please like the video, support the channel. If you like the content, support it. On that note, stay safe. Keep on keeping on. See you in the next video.